the asset and wealth management industry in Asia is going through a, a, a big shift. Um, the economic uh, situation where the new environment is low interest rate and low growth is putting pressure on, on, on fund managers and asset and wealth managers um, uh, margins. Uh, there's a big demographic change um, with aging population, a transfer of wealth, to new generation and, and the emergence of uh, a, a middle class uh, looking for saving and combined with uh, the digital and mobile um, uh, revolution where um, uh, billion of, of people and devices are connected uh, through real-time connections uh, is changing and reinventing the way investors interact, uh, access information and make decisions. Um, that has a lot of opportunities for the industry um, as new pools of wealth are being created and looking for investment solutions. It also has a lot of challenges and threats for uh, the industry as uh, this new pool of, of, of asset will come from a very diverse universe of, of investors uh, uh, basically moving from the traditional client base, uh, baby boomers, to um, new generation which has which have very different um, behaviors uh, um, and, and requirements. Um, asset managers that will uh, uh, be able to leverage financial technology um, to, 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 to build these new capabilities, to understand these new clients, to reduce the cost of manufacturing and distribution, distributing their product, um, uh, will be the winners. Um, the ones that are not able or to, or to, 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 to leverage financial te technology or are moving too slowly uh, will risk uh, to face, uh, to, to, to fall behind and face extin extinction at the hand of all competitors or new uh, like uh, fintech companies.